I'm Hannah with ID8 TV once again, and I am joined here now with Jim Hellman. How are you doing today? Good. How are you, Hannah? Very good. Thank you for asking. How, like, is this your first year at the scuba show? Well, I've come to the scuba show every year for the last 20 years, maybe. 20 years. Wow. So but I have here. only exhibited this year. This is the oh, first wow. exhibit. I exhibited once with Wyland's booth. Okay, awesome. And now it's all of your own photography and work, yes. which is beautiful, by the way. How yeah. did you get into, like, underwater photography? Well, I, I started out as an engineer oh. and doing all kinds of different stuff, and then I discovered the ocean, mm -hmm. and I had to find something that I can do in the ocean. So I went to work for a company that designed some new high-tech laser scanner, which was my first camera. I designed the control system for that, so I got to travel all over oh, the world wow. with it. And um, that hooked me on underwater photography, and I started doing photography myself. And I was struck by the fact that when you photograph things underwater, you get this much. And I wanted a lot more. So that kind of got my wheels turning, and eventually I came up with a way I could design a system to photo photograph things up close and then put them all together to make it a landscape that you can't see with your own eyes. So that made me realize that this is stuff that is really, really important to our world and our environment, and everybody needs to know about it. So the larger picture is I go and photograph coral reefs so I can share them with the world and let people know what's in the ocean that we need to protect. Because all of these places are the most colorful, beautiful places on the earth. They make the air that we breathe. They're very close and accessible to our shores, and we're polluting it with our garbage. And it's only because we don't know they're there. And if everybody could get to see what these places are like and what they mean and the fact that they are communities of animals and ecosystems that are just as important as our communities on Earth, then maybe they're going to protect them and we can save the coral reefs like we save some of the whales. Oh, I totally agree because I feel like people nowadays, it's all about like seeing is believing and so at least you're being able to like and like I'm like distracted by all this. This is amazing. And like you said, you don't normally get the full landscape of like photography. It's when you're like looking at photos of the ocean and everything. Were you a scuba diver before, or did you have to learn to be able to do this? I started diving in San Diego in the '80s, and I, I did thousands of dives before I picked up a camera. Okay, nice. And then uh, I think the thing that attracted me to diving was I made this realization that I probably wasn't going to be an astronaut but this was the last frontier and we can explore the universe right here on our own planet and you can get in the water anywhere and see something nobody has ever seen before. A hundred percent agree with that. What is the coolest place you have been to that you've gone to see? Oh my, almost every place in the world is cool. If we go, if there's, if there's, if you can get in the water, it's going to be neat, but uh, the Philippines is outrageous. It's considered to be the center of the center of biodiversity on the planet. So they have hundreds and hundreds of species of corals and more endemic species than almost anywhere else. Oh, wow. I've seen some like little signs for National Geographic. So have some of your photos been like featured in their magazine? Uh, one of my big images, the one on this other side that we're okay. not in front of, uh, <laughs> was, was, was in the it. magazine in okay. uh, 2001. Oh, okay. It's what cool. started this whole portrait of a coral reef project of mine. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, I love it. I have a roommate even who's totally into photography, especially like nature's beauty and trying to capture it. and so I know he's going to be really interested in watching this segment with you. So thank you so much for your time. You thank are you. amazing. I love your artwork. Once again, Jim Hellman, check his stuff out because it is great.